Hello everyone, I'm gonna wait for some people to come into the room first before I start. All right, so we have two people, so I'll go ahead and start. All right, so I'm gonna try not to make this video extremely long, but I just wanted to um, go a little bit more in details with the types of teas that um, I have. If you comment in here, I won't be able to see it because it's kind of far away. I'll try to answer your questions um, after the video. All right, so first I'm going to start off with Cerecee tea. All right, um, Cerecee tea is a blood purifier. So this is a tea that's going to cleanse your blood. So if you have any type of um, blood issues or just anything in general that carries through your blood, Cerecee is going to flush out all of that stuff out of your blood. All right, and I did write some notes because I didn't want to miss anything as far as what different teas do. So I'm going to make sure I cover everything this time. All right. Um, also, it is a it's a type of tea that will it will get rid of any type of like worms that you have in your body. It's going to flush all of that out. Um, also it's going to, if you're constipated or if you suffer from, um, any type of constipation, you can drink serotonin and that will actually, um, help you, you know, go to the bathroom. All right. Also this decreases blood sugar levels. So if you're a type of person that you have, um, diabetes issues and you have high, you know, high sugar this is going to lower your blood sugar if you have high blood sugar. All right, also it is rich in vitamin A and C and it has calcium and iron in it also. All right, another thing that it does because it is a blood purifier and it you know cleanses out all of your blood it also um, will get rid of like any skin issues, so like eczema, psoriasis. It's going to help you with that. Um, also, clean, clearing up any type of rashes that you may have on your skin. If you do know anything about the skin, the skin is the biggest organ on your body. So, a lot of people think that they can treat skin issues just topical and think that, you know, because I sell a body butter. And they think that, okay, well, let me just go ahead and just, you know, get your body butter. And, you know, I have eczema, I have psoriasis. But a lot of times, it's an internal issue and you need to cleanse your body internally. So, Cerise is something that will cleanse your body internally also. So, it's best to find out what's going on inside of the body. So, um, also... It assists in fighting off the common cold. So if you ever feel yourself, uh, my bad, somebody was calling. So if you feel like um, that your body is, um, I lost my train of thought when that call came in. I'm so sorry. Okay. So if you feel like you're getting the common cold, if you have a sore throat, um, runny nose, issues like that symptoms of a cold or the flu if you have a fever you're getting chills you drink seriously and i drink it myself i also give it to the kids it will knock out almost anything i would say max within that week minimum i've seen it knock out things within two days and that's my own testimony um so yeah, also um, women, if once you have delivered a baby, okay, and you know your body is kind of out of whack, um, 
if you drank Cerise after birth, it's going to just flush your whole system and flush all of your organs after giving birth. Um, the other thing that I did miss is um, when it comes to women, when um, you're like on your period. This is, a I drink this that whole week because it will help you with cramps. If you're, if you have an issue where you like have really, really bad cramps, really bad nausea, you'll drink this and heat it up and drink it hot, the Cerecede, it will help with cramps. Like this guarantee. I have done it. I know I gave, you know, gave, uh, gave it to other people for cramps. It works guaranteed. Um, so yeah, that's for Cerecede. And then I also want to also plug in a black business owner. My outfit that I have on is from I am Queen Couture. So I want to go ahead and plug that in. My hair is done by Melissa St. Furman. So I want to give you guys a shout out. Um, I also have like my earrings. I sell these earrings. So I just want to give you guys a quick shout out because I support black businesses. Um, and then also, um, I want to shout out Herbs and Earth. That's the place. I, I love that place. And it's great for getting like your crystals and everything. Like I got this, um, this necklace here and this onyx necklace. This is obsidian and tiger's eye. So I want to plug that in also as well. All right. So I'm going to move on to the next T and hopefully I don't forget anything. Again, I did write notes down so I don't have to forget anything. And again, if you have any questions, I'm going to try to answer it during the live. I can't really see it because, the, like, the phone is far away. Um, but I'll try my best to answer it after the video. All right. So, the next tea I have, which is one of my favorite teas, is Bilderberry. Okay. It is part of the Blueberry family, so it's very similar. This is, like, one of my... Cerecy is my favorite also, but I'm starting to... Cerecy, let me go back. I'm so sorry. Okay, so let me go back to Cerecy. The other disclaimer about Cerecy is you cannot drink too much of this. Meaning, if you drink, me personally, I will only drink eight, eight ounces a day. So like a glass a day. And that's because my body is used to drinking Cerecy. Some people, you might have to even drink less. Like once you start to get lightheaded or start to get headaches, that means that you need to stop drinking it for a couple of days because it is a detox. So it is detoxing your system. That is very, very, very important when you're drinking Cerise. So I tell my clients to drink only four ounces in the morning, four ounces in the afternoon or at night and that is it like split it up if you're not used to drinking seriously until your body gets used to it drink it for that first week the next week do not drink it at all and then you can go back to drinking it again because again it is a detox it can be damaging to your organs if you drink too much of it so that's a disclaimer about seriously so you can also use Cerecede as a skin, like, topical instead of, like, you know, drinking it. You can use it on your skin. It's a great skin purifier. Um, if you do any type of spiritual baths or you can, you know, if you want to just sit in it or whatever and cleanse your body, you can also do that as a bath. So, I'm going to move on to Bilderberry. Oh, Bilberry. All right, now... Bilberry is a type of tea you can drink every single day. It doesn't have any type of limitations on it. It is in the blueberry family. Um, now, so, Bilberry is, a lot of people take this for their eyes, if you have any eye issues. So, if you suffer from glaucoma, if you suffer from cataracts, if you suffer from macular degeneration, if you suffer from dry eyes, redness, 
any type of issues with your eyes, bilberry will be the tea for you. Okay. Um, there's also been studies where um, people have taken bilberry and they have their eyesight has have improved over time of drinking bilberry, you know, every day. Um, it also works as far as drinking it and your night vision also improves. Okay, so again, this is great for cataracts. This is great for glaucoma. Now, if you're a diabetic and you have high blood sugar issues, this is a great tea for regulating your sugar levels as well. Um, if you have mild inflammation, anywhere in your body, if you have mild inflammation, bilberry will be the tea for you also. The other thing is, again, because it deals with diabetes, this is a tea that will treat urinary tract infections and kidney infections. So um, if you have any issues with that, My bad, the phone dropped. Okay. Okay, so yeah, so if you have any issues with um, kidney infections, if you have any issues with urinary tract infections, you drink bilderberries, natural, don't take any, well, I'll say this, instead of taking medication, you can drink bilberry and it will flush out your system. Um, it's also good for, again, another T for treating skin conditions like psoriasis, like eczema. It's good for treating skin infections, not skin infections, skin um, conditions, cleaning out, you know, your system inside out. It's also good for treating diarrhea. So say if you got food poisoning or something like that and... Um, you know, you don't want to take any medication. You can drink bilberry and it'll help stop the diarrhea. Um, it's also good for treating hemorrhoids, a natural way to treat hemorrhoids. Um, another thing is treating varicose veins. If you suffer from that, bilberry is good for varicose veins. It's also good for treating muscular degeneration. Um, it, it improves your blood circulation. So if you have issues with, you know, circulation in your blood, it will help treat that as well. All right. This helps with chest pain. So if you're a person that you suffer from chest pain or anxiety, things like that, this will help with chest pain. Um, it also helps with if you have um, hardening in your arteries. And I would say like more so like with your heart this will help you know with that issue with hardening in the arteries um it helps with treating arthritis and um chronic fatigue syndrome so if you find yourself tired a lot this will help you with that all right so bilberry has a lot of great benefits um you know treats all kinds of different things more so with blood circulation, diabetes, especially for your eyes. Um, a lot of people use it instead of, um, they call it like the eye bright or whatever. They use this instead of that. So I would say anything, any type of issues that you have, there's a herbal alternative to medicine to treat yourself. So that's for bilberry. Um, and this is one that I'm actually drinking right now because um, I'm like borderline diabetic. Also, um, with my eyes, I don't have great eyesight. I don't have really bad eyes, but um, it's hard for me to sit at night. So I'm going to start drinking it to improve that for me. Um, and that is bilberry. So last but not least. We have licorice root tea. So licorice root tea. This helps with 
So first I'm going to start off with um, inflammation. So if you have any type of inflammation going on in your system, this will help with that. Um, it helps with reducing the um, risk in cardiovascular disease. So if you know you have cardiovascular disease in your family and um, you want to, you know, drink it just to prevent, it helps with that. Um, also for the licorice tea, it protects the brain. So that's, that's a really good benefit to that. This also helps to prevent cancer growth. So if you're a patient that you're on a cancer regimen right now or you're in remission with breast cancer, any type of cancer, if you drink licorice tea, it will help to keep the growth down the cancer so the cancer doesn't grow back. Um, also, if you just have one type of cancer, so say if you have breast cancer and it's not metastatic breast cancer yet, which means that it's spreading to the other areas, this will help prevent the breast cancer from spreading anywhere else. All right, um, also it helps with inflammation in the gastrointestinal area. So if you have stomach issues where um, you have inflammation there, if you have ulcers, situations like that licorice tea will help with that as well all right um and if you are so if you're of the age that you're in menopause and you have the hot flashes um the sweats you know this tea licorice tea will help with um the menopause symptoms so it'll keep the menopause symptoms down so i would say if you drink maybe a glass a day or whatever, a cup a day, that will keep those symptoms of menopause down. All right, and it also help with infection. So say if you have a, um, like a chest infection, anything like that, this tea will help clear out that infection. And then last but not least, um, if you suffer from PCOS, and PCOS is polycystic ovarian syndrome. So if you suffer from that, this tea is specifically for that. And this will help control those symptoms that you have and the actual um, cause of PCOS. So I would say like, cause they, there's no really known cause for PCOS, but whatever triggers that in your body this tea will help kind of keep those symptoms down so the symptoms that you have with you know pcos um it will help with that all right and then i would also you know just include that with you know with the coronavirus and with everything that's going on basically coronavirus is a virus that is it builds up with mucus okay so you have to think about what is going to eliminate mucus and mucus feeds off the bad bacteria in our bodies so for instance a, a tea like cerise which cleanses out your blood infections carry in your blood and everything like that you drink cerise this is going to detox your whole body this is going to knock out the flu the cold um, anything that is mucus building up, this tea, Cerise tea, is going to knock that out. Also, you know, I would say if you suffer from any type of illnesses that I have named, for the fact that the coronavirus is out in the world right now, and for the fact that it is airborne, and it can live on surfaces and all of that, and you know you have a compromised immune system or you know a family member that has a compromised immune system to prevent those symptoms of the coronavirus and getting that is great to as a defense 
it's great to drink one of these teas because that's going to protect your body. That's going to keep your immune system up. And also, I would say eating healthy. So, I always ask my customers, clients, I always ask them before they purchase anything from me as far as tea goes or even my creams or whatever. Hey, how is your diet? Because if you're a person that you smoke cigarettes and I'm not bashing any of these things, I'm just being real and being honest up, you know, up front. If you smoke cigarettes, right? All right. Ugh, it's now it's crooked. Okay. So if you smoke cigarettes, if you know you don't eat healthy, if you know you eat a lot of junk food, you know you eat a lot of fast food, um, you don't take care of your body, but you want to buy something that's going to put a Band-Aid on it, it is not going to work for you. I'm just going to be honest with you. It's going to temporarily detox your body, yes, but if you're steady putting garbage and toxins into your body, and then you're trying to put something good into it. It's, it just it, de it defeats the purpose. So I would say first start off eating. Try to eat as healthy as as you can as possible. You know um, that's going to really help you with anything. But with what's going on right now with the coronavirus, this is anybody can get it, and I don't worry about getting it. I go to the store, I don't, let me be honest with y'all, I go to the store, I do not have no mask, I do not have gloves on, because I know, hey, if I do get it, which I don't believe I will, because I don't have a compromised immune system, my immune system is great. Last year, I probably had a symptom of a cold for two days, a symptom, which means probably a runny nose. As soon as I get a runny nose, I drink me some Cerecee. Is gone in two days. I don't even remember the last time I got sick. I do not take the flu shot. I have not had the flu the flu shot in maybe um, I want to say ten years. I have not had the flu in ten years. Um, I don't get sick often, and that's because you know I take care of myself. And I'm just speaking on me. But if you know that you do you know if you have lupus or anything like that which you can't you know lupus or um, sickle cell anything like that you have a compromised immune system so to protect yourself you know follow your doctor's orders because i would never tell anybody not to do that but also do things preventive preventive wise herbally things that come from the earth to help protect your body so I'm going to use this time for anybody that has questions. Um, if you want to ask any questions. All right. So I see someone ask, do I ship? Yes, I do ship. I will ship you the herbs and I will send you directions on how to make the tea and also how to take the tea. People that are local, I do make the teas like th these three teas are for someone. Um, and on here, I put the instructions and then I also have a disclaimer on here because no I am NOT a doctor I am going to school for alternative medicine but no I am NOT a doctor so I put a disclaimer on here um, you know basically letting you know you taking my herbs as at your own risk um, but yes I do ship so let me see if I have any other questions or if you have any questions put them in the in the comment section so let's see All right, so since there's no questions, um, 
I'm going to end this live. I hope I didn't forget anything this time. Um, if I do <laughs> look at look back at it again and I feel like I left anything out, I will make another video again. Um, I do have other teas that I make. Um, I just haven't um, made any videos about them. But any of my products that you want to purchase, the sea moss mask, um, the shea butter, all the different products I have, um, inbox me. I will send you a product list. And um, also, I want to go ahead and get a shout out to my sister, um, Anya, on Facebook. Her name is Anya Belinda. And it's the page that have the the health and beauty products on it. She sells sea moss and she also has health and beauty products. The sea moss has 92 minerals, which your body needs 102 minerals in it. So sea moss is like great for your body. I drink sea moss, well, it's a jelly form. So I take sea moss every single day. You can put it in smoothies, you can put it in teas, you can put it in your coffee. Um, it does have a uh, weird taste, so that's why I mix it into everything else. When you put it in your tea and you put it in your coffee or your smoothies, you do not taste it. Some people just take a spoon and, you know, I'm not, I'm not that bold. I can't do that, but, or I just choose not to do that. But, um, yeah, she sells sea moss. Um, it's great for your body. So... Go ahead and inbox her. Her name is Anya. It's A N Y A Belinda B E L I N D A. When you see the two pages pop up, it's the page that has the health and beauty products on it, not the page that has her like a profile picture. Um, inbox her for the sea moss. Um, let's see what else. And um. All right, so I'm going to head in in this video. Y'all have a wonderful, blessed, great day. Be safe out there. Take care of yourself. And um, y'all have a great day. Bye.